everybody that I respect in this business said that Juan Soto is definitely getting traded. Definitely. And what the Padres want, because they're losing Blake Snell, is any pitching. They want ready-made young pitching. And the Yankees have that. If I'm the Yankees, would I give up Clark Schmidt and the kid Hampton and the minors for him? In a second, even for one year of them, I would do that. I like Clark Schmidt, but you give me Juan Soto for one year, I would do it. Now, the Mets want Soto as well, but the Mets desperately need pitching. So they might not have it. The Cubs and the Mariners are supposedly interested in well as well. So there was some thought, well, they would keep going for it as long as Seidler was around. But Seidler passes away today. And you look at the roster and all the, all the deals that he, he gave out. Bogarts, 13-year deal, no trade clause. Hugh Darvish, no trade clause. Um, Machado, no trade clause. Tatis, no trade clause. No, no trade clause. Complete blanket, no trade. So they've got to get rid of money because of the fact that they took a $50 million loan to meet payroll in September. And now their owner, who would do anything to bring a championship to San Diego, is no longer with us. They might have a fire sale. And maybe some of those guys with the no trade clauses, they want out as well. But I really believe now, I, even before Mr. Seidler passed away today, that, that Soto was going to get traded. And I'm telling you, you want to change the narrative about all the what seems crazy in the Bronx lately? You get Soto, and fans will shut up. They will shut up.